All right, so our lock is locked. Hello, come in, please. And there we go. I'm in my house, and it relocks. All right, so today we have a new smart lock. Well, I don't know if this one's really smart, but it's a fingerprint lock. I guess it's actually not smart. Special thanks to this company who were nice enough to send us their fingerprint door lock with keypads. This lock can be opened with either a pin, your fingerprint, or little tap and go keypads that are included, or also, of course, a traditional key, as you can see here on the front. So thanks to the company for sending this to me. We're gonna go through the unboxing and get this set up and show you what it would actually look like on your door. So let's jump on the overhead rig and go through the unboxing and then we'll set it up. But first, of course, click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. And now let's check out this fingerprint lock. All right, so let's unbox this fingerprint door lock. Now, on the front, just a nice picture of what it'll look like. You can see your fingerprint lock is here, pin code is there, and of course, door handle. Top, after you install the lock, please set the administrator password first. You can lock and unlock the lock with physical keys, passwords, fingerprints, and IC cards. Please read the relevant code section in the manual carefully and follow the prompts to set your door lock. If you encounter any problems, please feel free to contact them. Bottom, fingerprint, IC card, physical key, green keypad, no extra hole, so no drilling. And they have a black version and silver. This is the silver, and that's just uh, company info over here. So let's open this on up, see what we get in here. Voila. So they do have the template in case that uh, you need to drill. And then, of course, right on top, a nice user's manual, which hopefully this will have. And that's yeah, just foam. All right, so here is one part of the lock. And of course it's like this because, you know, it's not set up. This looks to be the back. Like this looks like where the, yeah. Very weird design for the batteries, but four AA, AAA, AA, four AA batteries it needs. Those might be included. This is the part that's on the inside. This is what you would see from the inside of your house. Over here, this is what you would see from the outside of your house. Your regular key, thumbprint to open the door, and of course, you know, this can go either direction. There is a USB-C port here on the bottom that should give this a boost in case the battery died to where you could still get into your house, of course. This does light up, so there's not actually numbers there, but we'll peel that off. Looks like, yeah, the only other thing down in here. That's it for the box. Is this looks like the accessories kit, which should have keys and stuff like that. That's it for that. So yeah, the main part of the door, the little plates for the door, backup screws. Look at that, they gave backup screws. That's amazing. Three keys, very nice. Oh, and look at this, they got it labeled. Steps, four, three, wow. And then these, these are like little tap and go uh, keys essentially as well. All right, so that is everything for the unboxing of this. Now we're gonna put this one on my mother-in-law's door. So let's get over to her house and get this set up and show you the setup process here. We've got everything laid out here, including some M&Ms to eat while we're putting this on. So let's get this lock off and then uh, we'll get this lock on. We're gonna take this lock off. We should have put you in a bikini and then have, have, a, have the clickbait, yeah. <laughs> All right, the old lock is off. And now we can go through the process of putting the new one on. So we'll start with the uh, outside portion. All right, so we'll slide this in. All right, so now we'll screw this into place and then we will put this plate on. The main part is installed. Now we can slide through the main lock. I'll help you uh, guide the wire. So at this part, you'll want to double check the instructions because there is a small screw, screw 3.2, that goes into the lock to keep the lock from moving all around left and right once you pick the direction. It'll look like that in the end. There's also a screw that goes right here to keep this side of the lock from moving all around either. I assume. Yeah, the wire just goes underneath. Underneath? Yeah. Okay. Bingo. Nicely done, Michael. I guess I'm in the back piece. Yeah. Now we take our back piece. All right, so this actually comes apart. So this is the back. 
and there's the other half of it. And so we're gonna run the cable through. You run it through one of these holes here, this one or this one, and then we'll get this plate actually mounted on so that the uh, front won't be about to fall off. So we'll throw this on and then catch back up. So we routed our cable through, have it plugged in. Now we can put our screws through to actually tighten it. Now we can, uh, I guess, we can put our batteries in last. We can put the other half on. All right, so we fixed our plate over here before we... Hey, yeah, look at that. That works. And so it is installed. We can now peel that on off. And you can see it's nicely flush. Looks really good. So we're going to pop our four AA batteries in here that are not included. So make sure you buy those when you order this lock. And then we should have power to be able to use it. Oh, it Please up. set the time. Please set the time. All right. Well, there we go. Now let's go through the setup process. So just so you're aware, don't freak out if this doesn't work. We're still in test mode here. When it's green, it works. So that's what you gotta remember. All right, so right in here is your reset button. We are done with this, so I can pop this back on. It just kind of goes over and up and in place. There we go. So now we can get in as the default user to add a new admin password. All right, so now we're gonna go through the setup process, at least with the admin password. So you basically just touch it to wake it up and do star pound. Put in the new password. All right, so our lock is locked. Hello, come in, please. And there we go. I'm in my house and it relocks. And essentially, this instruction list has everything how to get into the admin, how to make users, delete users, set up fingerprints, all of that. All right, and so that will do it for this fingerprint lock. Now, as you've seen on this setup video, this one is a little different than most of them as it does not use an app at all. You're able to just star pound to get into the menu and then follow the prompts to add users, delete users, add your fingerprints, etc. It's still a smart lock, just of course, without the app features. So of course, I'll have this exact fingerprint door lock linked down below in my description if you'd like to grab one of these for yourself. And that should do it for today's video. Click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch, and we'll see you in the next one. Deuces.